What's up guys, welcome back to the channel. So if you watched our last video, you know that me and Aika are heading to go see a condo that I wanna show her. That he wants us to buy. Mind you, we've been in our house for a little over a year over and a year. this man already wants us to look at another condo and buy. <laughs> I, I, it, it looks good, okay? okay we'll it looks see, we'll great. see. I have an open mind. I have an open mind. You got an open I have mind. an open mind, that's, yeah. That's all I ask, baby. Let's go check it out. So we're just pulling up. So the next time you guys see us, we are going to be inside the condo. Yes, we'll see you guys soon. Okay, guys. So we just walked in the front door. Baby, first impressions. I'm interested. Okay. That's all I'm going to say. I'm a little interested, but let's oh, do the tour. I didn't see everything. So everything will be like first reaction. I just gonna like ran and then ran back. Okay, and you didn't see the bedroom or nothing? No, okay. I didn't see the bedrooms or nothing. Okay, so we just walked in, front door's right here. Right off to our right is the bedroom. So let's go check that out. Okay, yeah. <laughs> okay, so this is one of the bedrooms. There's okay. three bedrooms in this condo, okay? okay. You know. Wow, this is nice. This, this view is nice. is nice. Right? Yeah. We're talking high floor. So for those of you who know Toronto, that's the Rogers Center. That's where they play like baseball, concerts, all that stuff. The CN Tower is right there. We're just blocked out. Just barely. Would this be your office? I think this would be the office, to be honest. Okay. I think this would be the office. So I would position my desk facing the window. What do you think? Let's go. Okay, Ika's not interested in this room, that's fine. Lead the way, lead the way, Mr. Realtor, You want Realtor, me to sir? lead the way? Okay. Yes, Mr. Realtor, so, sir. we're leaving that bedroom, front door's right there. This is kind of like the hallway foyer entrance. There is a little powder room off to the right. Okay. I do like that there is a powder room, because just like in our house, we do have one, and I like that our guests have somewhere to like use and not like the, our main bathroom. 100%. So this is like, if we're entertaining, you know, this is where the guests are gonna be using the bathroom. And us too. And us too. Yeah. But they don't have to go to like the bedrooms. And you know, like condos, you know, they're tight for size. You know, sometimes you don't have that luxury. Okay, baby, but I'm gonna let you go. Okay. And see. This is nice. This is nice. This is nice. It's nice, right? It's nice, yes. And how do we feel? Do you feel- I'm trying to picture myself living here. Would you be open to changing this? What, what, what do you want to change, baby? The brick. The, the, the stone? The, the stone, yeah. I think the stone's pretty good, but hang on. We could change it, okay? okay. Okay. We could change it. I'm just going to say it probably wouldn't happen right away because this place is pretty expensive and I don't know, you know... Want to convince me or not? Yes, we'll change okay. it. Okay. We'll okay. Change. That's all I was asking. <laughs> we'll change it. But how good is this living room? Like this is entertaining goals right here, right? We've got a corner unit. we got views south. we got views east. We can almost see the CN Tower right there, but it's massive. Look, there's enough room for a piano. That's a tip of the CN You know what? That's fine. It, it, it's fine. Well, well, I'll take it. I'll take it. Okay. You still, it's very, you the know. The view is still nicer, right? Baby. Because we are downtown. Baby. How big is this place? Because our house is big and we have lots of room. How big are we talking? So this place is 1,775 square feet. Three bedrooms, three bathrooms. Okay, Mr. Realtor, sir. Take us to the bedroom. I did some research, okay? okay. Maybe the kitchen. We'll do the kitchen, but I just want you to note that this place is so big that you can fit a grand piano in our condo in the sky. Oh, I know. This is basically, this is basically our old condo just souped up. Like it's yeah, double the size. Yeah, we definitely have to paint the walls white. Right. For sure. It's very masculine right now. Very masculine. Which is probably part of the reason why it drew me to it. But so, you know, once you get over the great, you know, feature wall over here and, and the nice living space, you know, I can see the parties, right, baby? You can see the parties. Honey, I'm not going to have a bunch of people over. It's just going to be me, you, and the sky, and the kids. Speaking of the kids, where are they going to sleep? There's three bedrooms. Okay, and you're claiming one for your office. So, we can work on that. You know, I'll, I'll have my office temporary somewhere for the meantime, but we're thinking about getting the boys an investment condo. It's gonna be downtown. Yeah. Maybe we can find something else in the building. We're looking for a condo for the kids um, so that they'll have their own condo and it is downtown. So, okay, I see where you're going. Revelations. The house will be too big for us at that point. You know, this is the perfect site because the house is about what? 2,750 square feet. This is about a thousand square feet smaller, but we don't even use half the house. No, we don't. We don't use the basement at all. Right? So this would be like the ultimate 
grown up living situation. Okay? But anyway. Elijah's only 15, though. Yeah, and Elijah, Elijah, Elijah can stay. And then you know? Shot can have his own condo. Yeah. Okay, show me the rest. Come on. Okay, hang on, hang on. We gotta, we gotta show that there's a balcony right here. <laughs> There's a balcony right here that also has access from another one of the rooms, which we'll show you in a little bit. See, this guy's got the right idea. He's got the, you know, the, the entertaining going on with the piano, with the alcohol, with the fireplace and the TV. You can see I'm myself. not living to stay here to entertain people. No, I'm just saying, yeah. we do like to entertain. We do like to entertain. But how often, realistically, do we? Yeah, because even, we don't have time. Even, You're working all the time. Even if, maybe, you know, let's save that for another video, okay? <laughs> Let's continue on. I'm gonna get you into the kitchen, oh. okay? I want I want your thoughts on the kitchen. I mean, the kitchen is pretty basic. It's pretty whatever. It's pretty okay. I do like that it's open. The living room's right here. As I'm cooking, I can bother you. I like that. Yes. I love I love bothering you. It's very open. It's very and open. I, I will say, and again. I'm not selling the place, but I was looking at the old photos and they have recently renovated the kitchen. This is new countertops, new backsplash, new cabinets. So just because I know you like everything new and it was recently I do done. I like things new, yes. Even this light picture is like super cool, right? It's just kind of modern. The kitchen is a little small, but I feel like it would do. I mean, we don't cook that much anyways. All right. Okay? And then this seating area? Seating area. Potential temporary office. You know, we got our nice little pantry right behind you. The nice built-in seating area. Would this stay with the place? Yeah. Uh, that table wouldn't, but the benches would. And I mean, I will say that when you get to uh, a condo of this, you know, price point, a lot of times the furniture is negotiable. Okay. It's just because I don't know what I would do here, but yeah. Okay. We could have, we have the eating area at the island. There's enough room right here for a little table and still having your massive living room there. Partition this off and make a temporary office for say, your beloved realtor, <laughs> husband, fiance. Okay. Okay, I show see, I see you smiling no, and giggling. I see you smiling and giggling. More. Okay, I would like you to carry on down the hall. You see you? This is laundry. Laundry right here. Okay. Okay, another bathroom. This is a full bathroom. This is gonna be for the boys. Okay. Mm hmm I mean, it's okay. It's a bathroom. It's a bathroom. It's very modern. It's a big shower for a second yeah, bathroom. It's a like, it's bathroom. massive. This is? This is the other bedroom. Okay. So, other thing too, I could potentially make this into my office full time because it's closer to the bedroom and yeah, you know you that. love bothering me when you're in the bedroom and I'm in my office yeah so then and then the other bedroom is farther away from our room so actually I, it would probably make more sense to have this one as could we change this yes this we could change all that no no problem no problem oh no problem <laughs> no problem no problem okay. I, can, I can do that baby I know a guy Okay. 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 But very cool, right? We still have the windows. We got the nice views. This is actually the balcony right here. Okay. Now. Which one first, bedroom or? What do you think? What, what is Let's your, do the bedroom. What does your gut say? Maybe bedroom first. You want to save the bathroom for last? Yeah. Okay. I guess this is a closet, but it's locked. Probably because they have some, you know, expensive stuff inside of it. Yes. Uh, Let's see. Do we have lights? Yeah, it'd be nice to they, have some Because they light. do have the shades drawn. It's a little dark. It's a little dark, but you know what? It's not too bad. It's very masculine. You know, they got the picture of the gun here, which is like cool, you know, but we would change it up, okay? And the balcony is right over here. And then there's also the entrance to the balcony right here. Guys, I'm just being very quiet because I'm trying to visualize how I could change this room and not take it as it is because as Dem says, it's very masculine. And But I feel like once this is open and it's painted nice and white, it could work. Nice and bright. The yes. floors are dark and I was thinking about that. And I like dark floors, but I know you like light floors. I like floors that you don't think about. Yeah. Our floors and our home, it's too busy for me. It's too light. So I don't mind the dark floors to be honest. What a great time to sell. You're so funny. What a great time to You're sell. But what a bedroom, baby. For a primary bedroom. I mean. For a condo. It's not translating because I feel like it is a tad dark in here and the colors and na 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 But I'm visualizing. I'm visualizing. I'm visualizing. I'm visualizing. And there's another um, entrance to the balcony from the bedroom, correct? Yes. Okay. So you could wake up in the morning and you could go check out the balcony immediately from your bedroom. 
You're trying to sell this place. Now, <laughs> hang on. Now, I want you to head into your bathroom. Oh my god, you are too much, I swear. Okay. This is nice. One key feature that I would like to point out to you. What? Okay. Now, if you look at this vanity here, note how there is a little gap in the cabinet. For me to sit? For you to sit. And there's a little mirror here where you would do your makeup. Now, obviously, we would get a souped up version of this right here, but you could have quite the little makeup. You are actually funny. Okay, another thing I have to test, and I know it sounds ridiculous, but I am a content creator after all. How is the lighting in here? How is lighting in the bathroom? How is the lighting in, I can't see the closet. How big is the closet? Way ahead of you. Way ahead of you, okay? For the lighting in here, there's no windows in here, okay? Yeah, so it's not the best. Which means that we can control the lighting, maybe. See, right here, they've got very uh, soft burning lights. So they're very yellow, you know? We can change those bulbs out for a little bit higher. We can change out the mirrors with the little, the, the, the lighting around them. I you know? did say that the next bathroom I get, I wanted to have a window. And you got me a mirror. Not quite the window I was hoping for. But hang on, because if you just move over here, okay. there's a window right there. Oh, you really tried it. <laughs> I, I feel like I'm making progress. No, you are. Okay, I'm going to think about it. Do we have some time to think about it? We've got some time. It has been on the market for a little bit. You know, condos like this, they don't move particularly and quickly. And that's my worry with it. But you did say that we're staying here for a while. I just don't want to get into something that we can't sell later on. Mm -hmm. Our house, that's going to be a hot commodity at any year, 10 years from now, five years from now, any years from now, because it's a house in the city of Toronto. And I can hear a bunch of loudness. But I'm trying to shoot YouTube videos for the people. What is this going on down here? All the yelling and the sirens. It, it is the downside of living downtown. But I will say, you know, I wouldn't say that this condo isn't a hot commodity. The thing is when you get like, the price point on this is higher. Yeah. And when you get to this price point, we're looking for a very specific buyer. And there's not as many of those buyers, right? This condo is what, 2.5? 2.399. Oh, okay. That's not yeah, but baby, the entertain and the funny thing is, we've actually been in a very similar condo. Yes, we do have a friend who we have owns, a friend who owns in this building. They well. actually they actually own like a few floors. Yeah, up because this is a lower penthouse. They own the like real penthouse. So, um, which is where I when I saw this, I was like, ooh, I know this is a good unit. Let's go check it out. Okay, I'm thinking, guys, help me out here. What do you guys think? Do you guys think? This is something I should really consider. Or do you like our house? At first I thought it'd be 100% no, 100%, but now I'm like, it's not so bad. And we are getting the kids a condo downtown where like Rashad will be living there quite, you know, not soon, but whenever he wants to. And it's big enough where it could have all of us. What if we have future kids? Then what? Do you want your Just kids three bedrooms, kids? this place is massive. Yeah, but we have the kids. Whatever, like, well, yeah, Rashad will have his own place. But Elijah, Elijah's young. Elijah's only 15. We'll figure it out. Wow. We'll okay. figure it out. You I, like this place a lot. Okay, you know I what? Like we'll discuss. We'll discuss off camera. Okay. <laughs> um, guys, let me know. What do you think? Do you think we should sell and move the way Dimitri wants to? Or are you on the fence with moi? I don't know. Honestly, I'm not as, I'm not, it's not as cut and dry as I thought it would be, Dimitri. I'm telling you, and just picture it with some nice, like, finishes that you like. Some white paint. Yeah. You know, paint's cheap, whatever. We could paint this place for like five, six my thousand bucks. My problem is with, with you is, my, the problem with you, Dimitri, is you'll tell me I can do whatever I want. We'll come here, we'll live this way until we move again. You have to promise me that, like, this would go. You have it. Change. You have it in 4K. We will paint the walls. <laughs> we will paint the walls. And I will change the light bulbs in the bathroom to get you the lighting you need. Okay, I'll think about it. You guys also think about it with me. What do you guys think? We're also getting married. Do we have uh, time to sell a house, move, and plan a wedding? He wants to get married in September. I'm, I'm thinking next year, June. He's thinking September. And should we tell him where we're deciding to get married? One video at a time. Fine! One video, one decision at a time. I want to tell them everything. Okay. Okay. Okay, we're going to have a discussion. We'll be right back.